Saturday, April 8th, UNT hosted the Mean Green Invitational, a track and field event attended by 21 collegiate teams from across Texas and nearby states. I was very happy with the performances today. I thought everybody came in. Um, they've, they've been working to this potential all year. Um, so it was happy to see people come out and just, just let things happen and let, let, let loose and compete. Like I see everybody in practice every day and so like when they come out and they perform like how they're supposed to perform, like it's not really a surprise to me because I've seen the work that they put in. Throughout the day, UNT athletes competed in 46 men's and women's events with many standout performances by some of the youngest competitors on the team. The future is very bright, and we continue to say that, and these, these athletes that are very young, our freshman, our sophomore group, um, those are the ones that, like, they, they'll continue to perform at a high level. Our seniors, they, they, they provide great leadership for the young ones, um, and then they just really, they just really latch on, but uh, our freshmen, like, they're fearless, and I, that's what I really love about them is they just come out every week and they're just ready to go. The event also featured a send-off to 11 graduating members of the track and field squad. Seniors and their families gathered on the field prior to the final two events to receive a commemorative jersey and recognition for their efforts at UNT. And that was one thing that we talked about in our team meeting yesterday is like this is their last chance to, to compete at home in front of their families, in front of their friends. And so um, as a whole, I, I encouraged our athletes like, hey, if you're not competing, cheer on, root on somebody else and really help them continue to improve or progress or PR. Um, it's been kind of awesome just being able to compete one last time like at home with all my girlfriends and it really means a lot just to see like how far the program's come in the two years I've been here and to finish it off strong with the girls is amazing. I mean just the meeting of a team like we show up every single day at 6 a.m. and we're doing like the work nobody else wants to do and it's tough but we have everybody here together supporting one another and then thriving with one another and succeeding has been amazing over the past two years. It definitely has, it's a bittersweet moment because it's like, you know, you're fulfilling your dream. For me, it was always wanted to be a Division I uh, college athlete. So being able to be here at UNT to finish my last season is definitely amazing and emotional at the same time. I'm so grateful for the coaches and everyone who's poured all their energy into me from coaches in middle school, high school, Little Rock coaches, my teammates, my friends at Little Rock, and people who supported me with the transition here at UNT, Coach Marshall, all of them has been such a big impact in my year here at UNT. So go Mean Green. Because you know, I'm far away from home. <laughs> London isn't around the corner. I don't get to see my parents every weekend. However, I feel like this school is able to put me in the best possible situation in terms of my school. And obviously on the track, I get the best of the best right here. So. Um, it, it, it's sad, but my time at UNT has been, it's been eventful, but it's definitely been something I'll remember for the rest of my life. Definitely, it won't be the last time you guys see me on a track. I've got so much more to offer. I've got so many records to break and just a lot to do. Obviously, it's sad to see them go because uh, they've been a huge part of the program as a whole, but especially in my two years that I've been here. Um, but I'm very happy for them and I'm very happy for the direction that they're headed in, for the future for them, whether it's competing or moving on in life and being moms and dads and, and husbands and wives and, and things like that. Like those are the things that I'm happy about with, for them moving forward um, and, and going into their lives.